Good morning, family. You got the top dog here with another edition of the listening room. And it's 8 o'clock in the morning on a fine Sunday. And I just wanted to show you a few of the changes that I made in here. First of all, you can see that I don't have the iMac sitting in front of the recliner anymore. So the iMac moved over here. And I got YouTube on the iMac there. It's um, North Sea Jazz Fest. It's Chuck Loeb's band. So we got some jazz playing first thing in the morning. And I'm going to go around the room and show you how I set it up now. I still have the... Um, my um, MacBook Pro. You got to excuse me. My memory is a little lacking always. But um, anyway, I got the uh, MacBook Pro open up. We got some Earl Klug ready to go on that. Now that one is set to play on the other side of the room. I'll show you that in a little while. But anyway, um, like I said in the last video, I had moved the TIA 3300SR in here. So I moved him over here in the corner. It's sitting on top of my Tascam CD rewritable whatever that says down there, but it's a, um, I can make CDs on that. And we'll come on across the room. And I made the change over here. I had the TAC X 1000 in there, but that one is being sold. So I have the TAC X 2000 in there now. And my brother from another mother, Big Matt, got the Rebox. B77 going strong. He re replaced that BU meter, so everything is working on there. And let me back up a little bit and we'll come back across. You can see both of the systems the Pioneer system on the right and the Yamaha system on the left. Now, on the top of the Yamaha system, I had the Techniques 1506 sitting up there. But now, as you can see, I got my cognac sitting up there, front and center. Boy, that's enough to last me the rest of my life, because I hardly ever take a drink of anything. But anyway, I moved the 1506 over here, and that's where the TAC X 2000 R used to sit. And coming on over to the um, to the end, I got the um, Akai GX 636 sitting up there. Of course, you know I got my blue light on, and that'll give you a good idea of all the albums and all of the um, tapes that I've made. And those are all. Um, 10 inch tapes. I got some more down here. So I, I got a few left that are um, blank. But I've done a lot of recording in this room. Let me see. What else did I want to tell you? I'm going to give you the view from the recliner now. So this is what I was missing. Actually being able to um, see both systems. I can look over at the Pioneer. I can see all those um, blue VU meters bouncing back and forth. And I'm gonna show you what everything looks like now with that top light off. Now, this is the way I'm normally in here and that's my view of my systems sitting here in the recliner. So I can show you what everything is looking like here. Starting off with my blue light and just go around the room. So that's the that's the view of the whole room here. And I think I'm gonna leave it like that. I, I changed that iMac and put it over there 
on the desk. I wanted to try it. I was just trying to get it out from in front of me here in the recliner. So when I make um, videos on the iMac, I'll have to sit in the chair. I got a chair sitting in front of it right there. I have to sit over there and do it. Or I can just um, use the mouse and I can actually do it from, from here, from the recliner if I want to. And I'm gonna turn the light back on and show you something else. This is mainly for Marty. So we were talking about the um, cameras. I got a, um, a webcam sitting there and that's taking care of all of this on this side. I got a webcam there that takes care of both of the stereo systems. And I got a webcam sitting up here that's taking care of this side of the room. So it's covering all of that. And of course I got a webcam that comes with the computer, but I also have my own webcam sitting there because it's a lot better webcam that will get me when I'm sitting in front of the computer. So that's how the um, webcams are set up. Of course, there's my microphone right there. I wish I could have got that thing working with the MacBook Pro because that's what I was trying to use the OBS software with, but it wouldn't work. So I had to go back to using the iMac. And I'm not mad at it. The iMac gives me more room to work with. I can see it a whole lot better. But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna see if um, YouTube cens censors my video this time since I'm running a YouTube video. But we'll see. They'll probably still do something to it. But anyway, family, that's it from now from the listening room. And I didn't show you myself because I still have my pajamas and my bathrobe on. So I wasn't going to show that. But anyway, everybody, I hope you have a great Sunday. And we will talk to you later. The top dog is out of here.